Hey guys, what's going on? This is Christopher Zier, Mikey Allstar here, and today we have another minifigure showcase. Yay! So, uh, first off, you're probably wondering, hey, wait a second, didn't I say that I'd only be doing one video today and I'd be working on stop motion? Well, first off, yes, I'm going to work on stop motion, but second off, I decided that I would make uh, two more videos, uh, minifigure showcase videos. So I had so much fun doing the Darth Vader one, I figured may as well do two more, I mean, come on, two more videos? Sounds good to me, right? And yeah, so not really any other updates uh, right now. Pirates of the Shipwreck and VA Pirate. Expect to see those sometime this week. This week is almost over, so I mean, you can either guess it'll be Thursday or Friday. I'll leave you guys guessing. So yeah. Today we have an oldie but a goodie. So we've got uh, Gilderoy Lockhart from Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. And uh, this is a pretty cool minifigure. There are two different Gilderoy Lockhart figures. There is this one, and there is one in green, I believe. I think it's green. And, uh, yeah, these minifigures are pretty old. As you can see, that he's yellow-faced. So we're going to look at this minifigure in more detail. So, yeah. And when we know about this lighting, I'm not 100% sure about it yet, because, I mean, I can, like, yeah, that when I move around and stuff. So i got to figure out a new spot to put that. But uh, also, let me know just with the lighting in general. Do you like this? Uh, should I do something else? Because I've got another lamp that I'm going to test out. And if you guys want to see the other lamp, just let me know in the comment sections below. And the next video that I do, that's like, uh, like minifigure stuff, let me know. So, yeah. Alright, so here we go. We're going to start off with the legs, of course, which is the perfect starting point. You start from the bottom and then you go up to the top. And... So, this is a very interesting color. I'm not really sure what color this is, but I... I've never really seen it used in any other minifigure since this minifigure, so I guess you could say it's kind of a rare color in minifigures. If you guys can think of any other minifigure in the uh, that has used this color, let me know, because I'd be curious to find out about that. Anyway, so uh, this weird pinkish color, uh, his legs of course, there's no detail on his legs, which is perfectly fine, it suits the minifigure very well. And uh, the torso is very nice, I like this torso a lot. It uh, kind of has like this little vest thingy, and there's just a lot of different designs on this, like a uh, little scarf collar thingy. And uh, no back printing, this is a really old minifigure. So, yeah. And here are his arms. You see right there. He's got the same color throughout his whole body, including the cape, which is pretty nice. And, uh, yeah. Yellow hands, because this is an old minifigure, and of course he doesn't have gloves or anything on. And here's his cape, of course. It is just this color, and it is an old cape, obviously. And here is his face. I really like his face. I think they kind of captured him pretty well. And let's just take a look at that without the hair. It's a very unique face. Like, uh, the smile, the cheekbones, and the eyes, and just the uh, his expression and eyebrows and stuff is very unique. I like this a lot. It's a very cool minifigure. And here is his hair. It is a classic wavy-ish hair. Uh, you can also find this in the Robin, uh, not in the Robin set, in, a, in uh, the Batcave, the oldest Batcave. The Robin has this in black. And you can also find it in uh, Remus Lupin from Lego Harry Potter as well. I think there are two different versions of him that you can find this in. And it is uh, orange color, so very nice, very nice hairpiece. I like that hairpiece a lot. And, uh... Yeah, so that is Gilderoy Lockhart. Let me know what you think about this minifigure in the comment sections below. I think it is a pretty cool minifigure, very classic. And I think you can get this in the Chamber of Secrets set. I don't remember exactly what set it's from, but uh, it's a pretty old set. But I think you can probably find this guy on BrickLink and uh, eBay if you try hard enough. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video once again. And I'll see you guys in the next video, which will be another minifigure showcase. So I hope you are enjoying these as much as I am making them. And I'll see you guys later. Oh yeah, it's me, Mikey. Yay! Bye!